What's up, guys? Sunday at the Storm videos are back. You've got me, Anna, here, and... Seth. So, bringing these back, good to talk about what we're seeing with lifts, what we're looking at. And Daniel here, squat and multiply. He's cutting her a little high, but he's actually working on not over-dunking his warm-up so that he's able to mm -hmm. actually get more out of the briefs he's wearing. Yeah. Here I am pulling against bands. I've been working up to banded doubles or triples over the last cycle. It's been helping me a lot working on driving through the top end of my deadlift. And it's also like pre-fatiguing a little bit so she's getting more stimulus out of less weight on the top sets, which can be good or bad depending on how you look at it. And here's me with my cute little high bar and my cute little walk out and just a cute little squat. Cute? Yeah, very cute. Super adorable. Joao's three weeks out. Um, he's doing the Kirketa Classic, I think, right? Yep. Yeah. Taking top double here. It's like, I would prefer him take his air lower rather than shrugging the bar there, but... He's been working a lot on his pick in the mono recently, and it's come a long ways over the last week, but I think he still has... He's got more to dial in on the mono, because he's been walking out for so long that it's... The mono becomes... I don't say the mono is harder, but if you're used to a walkout, the mono can be harder to get tight. Yeah, that was me taking 352 or something. We got Kelly taking some single ply. She's recently started if, coming out, and she brings a lot of energy. If I was coaching, I would have wanted not Sarah's squat here, but Kelly's squat to be a little bit more back in the gear, but it is what it is. Here's Joe Jordan. The oldest man to squat 1,000 pounds is now lifting raw. And it's his first raw meet in a de over a decade, I think. So he's learning on how to get down to depth with the raw squat and he's still a little he, little on the high side but he's getting better he needs to get the proprioception and it's like mm -hmm. the only bad thing is if he can't be in the chair then no one's going to call it yeah. bad as whites this is what happens when you don't tell me when your top set is you get a video like that and <laughs> don't pay attention to dylan pay attention to chris keating's back squatting technique right now because that will explain a lot when you go to see his squat later in the video but Strong work for Dill. He's just kind of doing the fuck around, have fun program right now. So, what else let, is new? Yeah, <laughs> let him do his thing. Oh, this is Tommy's. I think fifth time picking. What is this? Five sixty-five. Yeah, and she's got a struggle bus on the camber bar as always, but that kind of makes it a valuable bar because if she can display strength on it well, yeah, she's good with the straight bar, but it's just a fight. Yeah. Here I am taking, I think this is 386 or something like that. I kind of like blew my load early and took too big of a jump and then had to dial back down. I was kind of fatigued from it, but that's and okay. I had a really shitty skill lap bowl, but yeah. here's Joe again fighting for yeah, he high. switched out wraps. He was trying to figure out which ones he likes better. Um, and I think he was able to kind of get a little bit deeper on these, but... Still needs a little more still needs to work. get to the raw standard. But we believe in him. He'll get there. I think that one was probably the, the lowest Closest. One. Yeah. Closest. And he ain't a man if you can't self-wrap. Here's Daniel taking something in the mid-tens reverse band. Mm -hmm. He picked a little bit too knees forward, which made him really have to fight to get back. But he corrected well, took her down there to pretty good depth for a multi-standard, and yeah. blew her up. I also feel like he went from like two plates to six plates to like eight plates to ten plates it was well, like pretty, pretty pretty crazy watching that happen that's pretty but. normal multi warm-ups and here's yeah. chris's i don't know what's going on here note the skin showing on the wraps the the nodding the, yeah. the positive self-affirmations of the way up yeah but i had a what the fuck moment running the rack on that one but that's okay strong squat yeah and we got james lebron the LeBron real lebron james. james i wonder if he can dunk but he's pretty tall check strong water but check this pick out how the pick is coming more from torso extension rather than just standing it up so i'd like to see him stack his torso better before the unrack but still handles i think just in a low low ace reverse monster his depth was awesome on strong, every set too yeah. strong dude he's gonna have good meat and here's me with a really shitty 505 three board to finish her up <laughs> and then gotta love a joe jordan spot he stayed close but there he is